Hi, my name is Len Aragon with TLC Plumbing. Today we're going to be talking about backflow preventer testing and why you need to have it tested every year. This is a fire suppression backflow system that we're going to be testing today. A fire suppression system is pressurized with water so that if there is a fire, the sprinklers immediately turn on to extinguish the fire. Fire suppression backflow systems are required to be tested annually to maintain the water pressure within the system and make sure that it is not leaking into the municipal water supply. There are three different types of containment backflow systems that most businesses have. Domestic water, fire suppression, and irrigation systems. Irrigation systems typically use non-potable water that needs to be kept out of the drinking water supply. A business can have more than one backflow preventer on their property. What are backflow preventers and why do you need one? Backflow prevention systems are devices that keep the water flowing in one direction into a building. Backflow itself happens when the water flows in the opposite direction from the normal flow. This can happen when the water pressure suddenly changes. The backflow preventer is designed to prevent water and other liquids that may be used in a building from re-entering and contaminating our drinking water supply. Backflow preventer valves are required for commercial properties throughout New Mexico and need to be tested and certified every year by a professional plumbing company that is certified to test backflow prevention systems. The city or local water authority will notify your business when it is time for your annual inspection. It is then up to you to schedule a test with the Certified Backflow Plumbing Company. TLC is certified and licensed to test all types of commercial backflow preventers. The test is done by using a backflow tester to test the components within the device and make sure the water does not re-enter the city water supply. For a fire suppression system like this, we need to do the following. Yeah, so the first thing we do is Shut the water off. Okay, water is shut. So this would be test number one right here. We're testing check valve number one. It's gotta be at a minimum of five pounds. 9.4 pounds. So that would be good. Then our second test is our relief valve opening. It needs to open at a minimum of two pounds. And then water will start dripping out of there. Now we're doing test three, which is we're sending water pressure back through check two. And then we have to see that that doesn't leak while it does that. So the way we do that is we just turn this on. And test three is that yes, there is not water leaking from check valve two when we put water backwards through it. And it's right about the 9.2 that we started with. We've got to switch our hoses. Now we're testing for the value of check valve two, which it has to hold at a minimum of one pound pressure. And it's holding at 2.8. What happens if your backflow preventer fails the test? If your system fails, it will need to be repaired or replaced. TLC's plumbers are certified and experienced to repair and replace backflow preventers. Once the repairs are made or the system is replaced, it needs to be retested to ensure the system is working properly. The most common problems we see with backflow preventers are leaks and water pressure issues. If you notice a leak in or around the backflow device, you should call TLC to inspect and evaluate the problem, even if you're not due for an annual test, or if you are experiencing water pressure problems at your business, call TLC to troubleshoot. Our plumbers can troubleshoot to see if the problem is within the main plumbing or the backflow preventer, and we're qualified to repair or replace the unit. TLC is licensed and certified to test, repair, or replace backflow preventers for commercial properties across the state of New Mexico. Call us today to schedule your backflow test. Thank you for watching. See you next time.